All right, to all you beautiful souls, hello, and to all you without souls, also hello. You're not an afterthought. In fact, I find you to be the most fascinating part of this whole equation, and I cannot wait to get to know you better. Speaking of getting to know people, if you're wondering who I am, know that you are not alone. I am wondering as well. For all intents and purposes, I am Simoleon, and this is my channel where I say things, random things, like, I love playing The Sims, and I hope you love people. What, what, what? Should I even bother continuing? I hope you love watching people play The Sims. Otherwise, this is a weird place for you to be. How did you get here? Either way, welcome to my channel. Kick your shoes off, feel the dust bunnies betwixt your toes, and let's play The Sims. For all aware and unaware, this is my let's play Cheese All That with our protagonist, Chi, on screen, looking a bit sad for a girl holding an acai bowl. I, I would, you know, hazard a guess that maybe it has something to do with the fire that is behind her. But I don't know. I don't know where that thought is coming from. It's just a hunch. Anyway, last episode, she had a really good day. From what I recall, it was love day, which she spent with Edom, and he got gave her like flower after flower, specifically twice. Um, and she gave him one too. And then she got herself some new clothes, which is great. New do, which is phenomenal. She sold an outfit on Trendy to Jeffrey Landgrab, I believe, Jeffrey. Yes. She had an overall good day. And I mean the highlight, the highlight, if you will, the low sound, if you won't, was that she went to the Starlight Accolades finally at the correct venue, dressed like everything, everything, point blank period. And we went in there expecting to not win anything. So tell me how we won something. <laughs> tell me how we won something. We won something. She looked stunning. That That's the end of that. Now, today, we have a couple of things on the docket. I believe we remember her doing a bit of a happy dance last episode because she has all the money she needs to get her food truck. <clears throat> yes. So she's going to do that, but she also has some more things to do today. She has to talk to Adam about them merging their lives because, you know, right now she she's she's a young adult. She has been in sim, you know, lifespan. She's been a young adult for enough time that I would say she's like in her mid 20s, you know? So she's going to have some serious chats with Adam, sell some more outfits on Trendy, but most importantly, host a dinner party for her friends because we haven't seen her friends in a bit and like what even is that like i can't be having my sims be acting the way that i act in real life i'm like sitting in my house just editing videos talking to my significant other where are my friends like my friends are looking for me and i'm like i don't know where you are because i'm choosing to be a homebody and they want to actually go out so we're not going to have her be like me because that's the thing she's not me she's a bit better <laughs> so we're gonna host a dinner party. I understand that we don't have a table here, a dinner table. Okay, so like 20s vibes, you know? You're in your 20s, you have a dinner party, people just come over and they just kind of sit around. That's that. So we're doing that. And then we're gonna have an opening day for the food truck, which I've never done before. I did get the Dine Out Reloaded mod. So it's gonna be great on that front. For all wondering what accent this is, even though no one is asking, and nobody cares and odds are everyone wants me to stop i don't know what this accent is i think it's just a cry for help saying that i want to watch love island so i can say different things in different accents and be like i'm from manchester i'm from liverpool and want to have a chat etc <laughs> i must move on okay let's get started now, if any random loud sound kicks on, it's because my AC kicked off right before I started recording. So at some point, it's just gonna, it's gonna sound like there's a mini tornado in here and I'm just gonna need you all to forgive me because I would rather have that happen than be sitting here with, you know, just like either boiling or whatever would happen if I turned off the heat. I'm, let me stop. Okay, let's get this started. Now, let's deal with the fire she uh yeah she looks a little upset what happened what happened was uh last night the gremlins came and look at her she's on the verge of tears oh my god um <laughs> the gremlins came last night and they ruined everything again it's getting to be too much i mean thank god we're gonna be living with adam soon because hello you know 
Okay, sis, what are you feeling? You need to pee. Well... <sighs> okay, anyway. I hired an emergency repair service so that he can fix stuff. So why don't you come repair this? In the meantime... I want this fire looking bigger. This guy better hurry up. He's been doing this one for a long time. What are your credentials? Uh... <sighs> this is too much. This is ultimately too much. Will he go fix something else? I locked him in the apartment, by the way. For anyone wondering, I locked him in here because I called the repair service earlier. They didn't show up. And then, oh, okay, good, he's fixing things. Your apartment rent is due 400 bucks. Okay. And then what? And then what? You know what I mean? Um, oh wait, there was a utility bill in there. Wait, what's happening? Oh, we got money. So much is going on, okay. Let's go in here and pay our utility bill. Pay everything. Boom. Okay. Now, what is this over here? Oh, the interest. Oh, why? I forgot we were getting interest. I, I'm going to Thrifty. I, I will be going. Don't you worry. Heaven's got a plan for you. My salmon is so cold. I don't even know if I should bother eating it. Okay, she's peed now. Mama, go and grab some leftovers. What do you want? You want another acai bowl. You know what? You're living your healthiest and thriviest life. She has a catering order today as well. This is one of them 3K ones. I feel like it's definitely something to work on. Um, when you're done eating, I'm going to have you go for a jog. I know it's raining. I know. But what's she going to do in here? Like, there's nothing to do. That said, this guy, <laughs> we can't trap him in here. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna fast forward through this until he's done cleaning and then we're gonna go for a jog. Oh no! Hey, he didn't even fix it? Hold on, right. yeah, girl, you better yoga. Just take this to the hamper and then come here and just do some energy centering because you really just wake up, you wake up <laughs> that means grammatical error you may hear that more or not to be honest i'd be saying that and then i just don't add it to my vocabulary so what is the point sorry for hitting my microphone speaking of microphones maybe once you're done doing your yoga you could come here and record i wonder what we're gonna record maybe a fashion tips video that would be shocking wouldn't it because she never does that like she she's like oh he came back Round two. All right. Let's see how this works for you. Please don't hurt yourself. I love her in the background just doing her thing. Sarah! Um. Hello? Did you die? You guys, please stop. I don't think he died. No! I have to unlock the door because death has to come in. And she just got paid a bunch of money too. What on earth is going on? Is this on me? Because I locked him in here. Girl, call another repair service. Things are still broken. <laughs> It's already scheduled. Yeah, but he died, bro. Oh, wait. I don't have more to my game. I can't, like, report this death. I need I need something to happen right now. Okay, Chidar, please. You don't know him, all right? Uh, <laughs> so insensitive. But also, call cancel the repair service. Thank you. And then call a new one while this is dealt with. Because I don't even know where Grim is at. And then you still have your hearing. That has not happened. All right. Uh, can we... No. Still not letting you. Hi, hi, Grim. Hi. Uh, I would plead, but I don't think I want to waste my pleading on this moment. Yeah, girl, you better go do yoga. She said I can't think straight. <laughs> Are you gonna take the urn with you, or? Yeah, yeah. Pull out your iPad. Thank you, Chitara. Can you call the repair service, please? What do you mean? Oh, maybe until he's off my lot. Girl, brain, brain your boost. 
<laughs> Bring your boost, please. Where are you gonna clean them? Well, I guess he fixed the sink. Okay, cool. That's fine. Grim, please. Oh, not his little phone case. Adorable. Ooh, 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 is it happening? Come on, swiper. Yes, swiping. Hello. Yes, swipe that joint. Mm. It's been swiped. Bye. No. No, no, no. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Wait, how do I... First of all, release the spirit because I don't want no mess. Yes, sir. Thank you for fixing my stuff finally. I'll put this in your inventory and I guess we'll deal with it later. <laughs> Grim. No, no. Don't hang out in my house. Yeah. Bye, Tyree. I'm so sorry you died fixing my thing. Ask for powers? No. Grim, please don't dance in my house. Please don't dance in my house. You can go. Thank you so much. My alarm is working though. Hey, yo, living my life like it's golden. You know what? While all this is going on, what are you getting? You're getting more food? Is everything okay? Like, I'm not at all shaming you, but like, that acai bowl did nothing in loving memory. What does that say? A cherished sim. No. Seeing a scary sim. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's the Grim Reaper baby. That joint is scary, no matter how you put it. Look at her little purse. Remember when I said she had to buy a purse when she was, you know, at the store? Girl, where are you going? Come show this purse. Look at her little purse. Oh, I can't. She dressed too cute with her little mom slippers. I call those the mom slippers because, like, you know, your Nigerian mom would just be wearing those kind of slippers out. Those are, like, the nice slippers, the fancy slippers and that. Yeah. Is there still mat? Is there still morning? I said he's not cherished. Get it out of here. Bad surroundings. Okay, mop. This is so frustrating. It's 1245. Nothing has been done. You know what? Maybe you should start cooking for your order because come chat with your client. To be honest, we don't even need to do that first. I don't know why I'm over here acting a fool. Um, no. Group breakfast dishes, 100%. Does, is there anything in here? Do we already start? Let me see. We start already. Nope, we did not stop. Okay. Um, let's make some brekkie. Tell me he's not done right now. Okay. Eggs and cereal. Let's make some corn beef. Come corn corned beef, not corn beefed. Oh. Struggling, man. What else? This is the only one left to be fixed. Oh. I ate a repair service for that one, mate. It won't even let her fix it. I don't know what's up with this tub. I'm not going to give a thousand dollars to fixing this. Like. Not her being stinky. Sir, she needs to shower. Like, why can't you fix it? Should I talk to him? Talk to him. Talk to him right now. I feel like no one can get to it. So I don't know why even. 157. 157. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to say that this added an extra 20 bucks. So one. 77 okay lock for everyone but household members and then okay so he already took the money so i'm just gonna remove yet yeah, repair this i have to cheat that repair i just have to because like okay so let's do this add it boom let's go okay why don't you take a quick shower my love you know what? Now you actually don't really have time. Maybe we should just let's go get this restaurant. And then we'll talk to Bay. What? You're still hungry? Chidera, stop. Stop. What's happening? Why are you making jollof rice? Oh, girl, I'm going to let you. If you miss home, you miss home. That's okay. You know what I'll have? Oh, not her slamming the frit. Are you still mad about this boy dying? No. No, you're not. No, you're not. No, I don't want to get rid of that one. Ugh, I got rid of the hearing thing. Well, whenever that darn hearing is anyway. Girl, resume your jollof rice. And then text your mom after. This will be the first time she's texting her mom. Yeah, we don't need your services. Thank you. Just 20 bucks for your trouble. Um, not, I remember the her and Balaji thing. Me saying remember as if it was not straight up yesterday. I don't know why the flirting thing is. Up yeah, my game like removed their relationship, which was very weird. Um, 
And so when they met for the first time a couple episodes ago, which was bizarre, they flirted with each other and then I had to like put in the relationship bit that they're siblings. Oh my gosh, Erica. Have you guys even seen Erica yet? It's the Grim Reaper. No music. Oh, you know what? Yes, listen to music. Turn up, turn up, turn up, turn up, turn up. I'm just kidding. Turn it off, turn it off. What is going on? Every emergency. Turn it off. Turn it off! I made jollof rice for the first time. Oh my god, she just made one plate. I made jollof rice for the first time recently. Yo, and it's jollof rice and plantain too. What? Look at the little plantains on the side. Is that a whole steak with it? Hey man, that's that's everyone's dream to have a whole steak with their jollof. Imagine you went to a restaurant and they offered you steak and jollof rice on, not just like white rice on the side with like some cilantro, like straight up jollof. Yo, mm. they could they could eat my money, man. I would just dash it to them at that point. Oh my god, yes, she said that food is good. It's excellent. Girl, it is four o'clock. Okay, eat this food. And you have to talk to your mom still. This is crazy. You know, why don't you call her when you get home? Eat this. What in the slow eating? Okay. We're going to go over here. Select an option. Let me save. She's finally full. Was that what made her full? Yikes. That is the only thing that made her full. Okay. Buy a restaurant. Here it is. It is 19,390 simoleons. Ward Park food truck. Lego. Oh, remaining funds, $715. Yeah, we're not gonna do anything necessarily while we're here. Now, I will say, I hate the way that perk points work in this game. So we're gonna do a, bunch, a little bit of setting up before she goes back home to finish her catering order. Actually, before she goes to meet Edem. Maybe she should go meet Edem. I don't know, maybe they should go to a restaurant together. Oh, transfer, girl. Transfer $200. Ah, maybe her and Edem should go somewhere that's free. Because I can't do this, man. Um, new business owner. Many Sims dream of being their own boss, and Chitara is cruising that dream right now. Yes, yes, she is. So you bought a restaurant. Now what? Um, don't tell me my business is gonna fail. All right, don't do that. Now we have to do quite a bit of setting up. So <laughs> let's save, and I might like speed through this part. So first things first. Let me see what the restaurant settings are. Price markup, 125. Now, I personally want the prices to be a lot more expensive than they are, but I'll just take it up to 175 for now, okay? Chefs will wear... I like that she would be wearing this, but like, realistically, she wouldn't be wearing that. So I do have to change the outfit. So let me just go change the female outfit. All right, so what do I want her to wear as a chef? I feel like she would just do... Hmm, I like the apron vibe, though, but I feel like maybe she would just do like a... Uh regular like oh no it's a full body it's a full body adi adi okay let's maybe i just pick something up here ah, gosh i mean she has to yeah because even when i go to nigerian restaurant here it's got a little bit of like you know okay i'll let her do that and i'll give you nice shoes don't worry and you're not gonna wear that hat take it off take it off no hat no i know i know kitchen rules but have you seen her hair no oh, i feel like i should though but i don't want it i don't want it so i'm not gonna <laughs> you wanna wear vans what are you feeling what are you feeling my good sis do you want to wear no those are too high. you want to feel us no well, you gotta wear closed toe shoes. You're in the kitchen. Ooh, wanna show your your money? No? Okay. Oh, look at these guys. Oh, adorable. Adorable. Yes. Okay. Should we do a hat? We're not doing a hat. We're simply not gonna do it. I won't be asked. Let's go. Um, and then we also have to set up our Carl's Dine Out settings. All right, so I'm gonna save, like, this would be for the females. This will be for the males for now because we're not gonna have any male chefs. Advertising. We'll do this tomorrow. Like, when, when she actually comes to open store. Because it's 4 o'clock. She's not gonna do this today. Um, but we're definitely going to advertise i just wanted to get some more money our host will just chill that's for sure okay i'm saving that i, I want to save that before i do the menu because the menu is not the hardest part i did i have my own personal save outside of this game that i have been using to look at them look at them did i not just say something did i not just say something like i specifically just like oh my god like y'all don't play with me oh oh my god should i go into i think if i go into this menu it'll be a bit easier <laughs> i don't know what's going on but somebody's testing my patience somewhere all right, y'all, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull up a restaurant for, I'm gonna pull up a restaurant. I'm gonna pull up the menu for my favorite Nigerian restaurant in my area. And I'm going to try to copy their menu as best I can. I'm definitely gonna put all my Nigerian, like, food on here, but it's just like drinks-wise, I think. Um, not avocado and banana puree being in the drink category. 
Okay, they would definitely have a Coke. They also would have like, they'd have like a ting. You know what I mean? Like those like different sodas, the foreign ones that taste so good. They have like pineapple flavor and all that stuff. So they would have some of that. I'll keep that in mind. Like I'll also keep in mind the kind of things that are grown back in Nigeria. So we grow melons. So like I had a lot of melon growing up, I think. Yeah. Um, so we'll keep that for now. Unless I run out of space. They definitely would have a Sprite. Sparkling apple juice, no. Like that reminds me of apple Fanta, but like there's a cinnamon stick in it, so no. What else would we have? I don't know if I want, that. like the, I would have the alcohol that like they tend to have, at, that I'm used to seeing or that I used to see in my childhood. So Guinness, yes. Heineken, yes. Those were like the main ones that I saw growing up. So I would have those two. What else do I want? I want a big ginger ale community, I will say. At least not that I saw. Any passion fruit, no. Apricot, Blue Mountain Mist. That's not even a flavor. That's just a bunch of words. Grape, mm, no. Raspberry, no. Um, so much melon stuff. Ooh, Tropical Gulp. That sounds pretty good. It sounds like it would have like pineapple and all that stuff in it. And we do have pineapple and coconut. So, yes. Is there anything else I want? Do we have Corona? I don't know. Not gonna. So, ooh, they just have, ooh, I wanna do it that way. Um, just, yeah. ooh, and you can get a Hennessy cocktail. That sounds pretty good. That sounds like something pretty decent. Long Island iced tea. I don't know. Um, I would just get an iced tea though. Because they normally... Would they have? No. Let me not say they would. Um, oh, a can of... Oh, there we go. I can get cans. Nice. But she's also a food truck. So I have to keep that in mind as well. Alright, so I'm going to get rid of this and this. And then I'm just going to have it be this way. Alright, that's a pretty good assortment. Now let's get rid of all of these. This was made to be a pho... Food, uh, food truck, and that's why it's already got like a custom menu here. Okay, so appetizers. Moi Moi has an appetizer for three bucks. Yes, Moi Moi is one of my favorite things. Um, I hated it when I was a kid, but I don't know. Like, it's like when your palate changes in adulthood. If this happens to anyone else, I feel like it probably does. Like, it hits so different. Like now, Moi Moi is a delicacy to me. I have to like teach myself how to make it because it's so healthy. Like, <laughs> it's such a healthy, delicious food, and it really fills you up as well. Like, it's it's literally just you know, beans. Like that that pink thing right there. This. This is beans. These are like completely blended beans. And then they'll put like an egg in the middle or corned beef or something. And it's like, it's it's not just beans though in that mix. You also, you mix it with like a tomato pepper blend and there's onions and everything. Oh, fried rice. Yes, we should definitely have fried rice. Wait, but as a starter? No. Let me, let me stop. Uh, things we would have are like puff puff and th chin chin. No, well, not chin chin, but if they had chin chin, I would like, I would like that. And I would put it in. Um, okay, so I'll do this because sausage rolls are a big thing. And if there's any kind of meat pie situation, meat pies are also, oh, sausage roll. I'll do that instead of this. So sausage bread is more like a sausage roll. And, oh, fried plantains. Absolutely. Yes, 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 yes. That's perfect. In fact, I think that's pretty much all we need. I'm just going to look and see if I miss anything. But I feel like that would get us through. Would we do wings? It's just not that common, man. I'm sorry. Uh, steak tartare. Watermelon salad. Papaya salad. We do love papaya. That's what we call it. We call papaya papaya. And that could be kind of cool. So papaya salad. Um, chimpanzee bread. Da, da, da. Hot and sour soup. Grapes. Oh, I can just get a plate of grapes. That's crazy. In like a, in a good way. Oh gosh, I have poutine in here? <laughs> That's funny. Um, crab cakes. I would love a crab cake right now. But would not go on the list though. Spicy sausage, no. Ooh, eggs! I mean, I would say yes, but no. They wouldn't just, I, don't, I, don't, I can't think of too many places that would have. <gasps> Chicken pepper soup? Heck, yes, that is actually, that's a straight up, yeah, yep. These are in the meals though. Hmm. I think these are also in the main course. I just, I can't pick them until I see if they're in the main course or not. Okay, I think I'm good on those. Let me take a look. Moi moi, sausage rolls, fried plantains, and pop salad. Perfect. If we go to main course here, we have a few options that I would like to work with. So let's get started. Moi moi's here again, but I'll just leave it alone in the other category. <gasps> oh, buddy, beetle stir fry. There's a bug in Nigeria called chingay. I truly don't know what it is in English. It just, it comes out in rainy season. And I used to get so scared because I knew that people ate those. And like... I always wanted to try it, but I'm just so scared of, like, eating a bug. Even though I know that, like, it's not that, like, bad for you if you eat the right one. Let me stop. Um, okay. Let's see. Look at that. Butter chicken and garlic knot. But no. Oxtail with rice and peas and plantain. See, I would normally put this in, but this is not a Nigerian dish. Like, we eat rice and beans, but not rice and peas like this. And oxtail is not something that's, like, super, super common to eat in the way that it is in actual cuisine. Oh, they have actual sausage rolls here. Where were they in the other thing? I have to add them in because like, I wanted them in the other category and I did not see them, but I, I want them on her menu. So there we go. I'm going slowly, even though I'm going to speed this up. <laughs> I'm going quite slowly because there's some that I always miss. And I'm just like in no mood. I'm going to put curry here because my mom growing up used to make this killer chicken curry with rice. 
Oh, just thinking about, like, I'm just thinking about it. It's making me salivate. There we go. I always miss this one. Egusi soup and fufu. I'm sure people know this. It's like, was making its way on TikTok and everything. Everyone loves some egusi soup. One funny thing about me is, I actually hated eating egusi at home. But whenever I would go out, if someone made egusi, I always wanted it. And it wasn't like it tasted different than my mom's did. It was just something that I only liked to eat outside of my house. So, like, it was the most irrational, like, aversion to a food. I don't know what it was, man. I think maybe it's because I always ate it quicker when I was outside the house. But at home, I never ate quickly. I would get a book and open it from my plate, sit down and read. And my food would get so cold. So even now, I eat really like cold food. And cold food. I said cold food twice. <laughs> Yikes. I would eat really cold food. And um, yeah, my friends always are like, why do you do that? And my partner's always like, why do you do that? And I'm just like, um, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I'm never in that much of a rush with my food. Like, I can eat it whenever. Okay, let's focus. Look at all this McDonald's. Um, boop, boop, boop. Fried catfish. See, like, it wouldn't look like this, but I should add this here because, like, we love our catfish. I will say that much. Even I love catfish. And it tastes so different back in Nigeria than it tastes here. Like, not even, like, specifically Nigeria. I think if anybody served me actual catfish, like, you cut it into, like, actual steaks with the bone in it and everything, I think I would always love it. But because everything is filleted here, like, I can genuinely say that it does not hit the same. I don't know if that's a controversial opinion or not, but we'll see. If that's what gets me off the internet, then, well, here we are. Full meat pie. I want actual meat pie. I'll, I'm going to put in the full meat pie for now. <sighs> full meat Wellington. Man. I want... I don't want pho. I want not pho. <laughs> um, oh my gosh. If I pass a meat pie, I'm going to be so upset with myself. But if I don't, it's okay. Steak is also not like a very like big thing. Like just to eat like a giant slab of meat. That's like what? Whenever I eat a steak, I like it. I, I, I get very full off of it. And I'm just like, why on earth do I need this much meat? Like this has to on some, on some level be wasteful. Because there are people in other parts of the world that are surviving. Like... And they're physically fit and everything, and they're not eating that entire part of an animal in one sitting. So, I don't know. I, I've started to really reconsider my relationship with steak. I think I just have it less is really what I should say. Ofada. Oh, this is my favorite food. My favorite food is ofada. Ofada stew. It is, it's a pepper stew. And normally with stew, you make it with, like, a blend of tomatoes, peppers, and onions, along with other seasonings. And then, like, your meat stock or your chicken stock. But ofada is meant to be spicy, so there's no tomato involved. You literally, you're literally just cooking. You're just like frying different types of peppers, bell peppers. Um, what are they called, tatashi? I don't know what that's called. But they're like Fresno peppers, I think. But like, it's not that they're bigger. Yeah, and then habanero peppers. Delicious, delicious. And you should have a small amount. Now, I'm going to put this mud carp here for now because we like to eat whole fish. Like, I love when my mom would come home with an entire... With like a roasted fish. Oh my god. I'm putting pancake stuff with me in because stuffed pancakes is something that I loved eating growing up. Like... We didn't do like sweet stuffed pancakes at my house. Our pancakes are always savory. So you make like a sauce with either like ground beef or corned beef or whatever protein you really wanted to. And you just like sauteed it with vegetables. And then you rolled it into your pancake, which is what people would call a crepe here. Um, but we just called it a pancake. And you roll it into that and then mom would slice it up for me. And oh, there is nothing like it. I make it now. I don't know how to make a pancake from scratch. <laughs> it is one of the biggest shames. But anyway, I go to Ikea because they sell those crepes in the food section of Ikea in a freezer bag. And they are quite delicious and you just either like fry them up on the stove you can put them in the microwave if you want but i personally will put them in the oven for a couple minutes there's like instructions on the bag and then i just have to worry about making the sauce delicioso i have been scrolling through this for so long <laughs> chicken pepper soup there we go okay i definitely oh seafood fo now we're getting somewhere all right fried catfish oh with mac and cheese we don't really do mac and cheese um bup, bup, bup. now we love us jollof spaghetti so i'm gonna put this in to say it's like the jollof spaghetti type beat because man oof spaghetti is different it's different i'm gonna put this creamy soup with salmon even though we wouldn't do it this way we would make like soup with like fufu or pound of yam so i'm gonna say this is like a seafood okra type of thing so i like that <laughs> i like how i just have to like make, make things up fried rice is a very big thing not necessarily pineapple fried rice but fried rice is huge this chicken stew with beans and green salad i will put in because we'd like to do a lot of chicken stew beef stew goat meat stew so i'm gonna keep that in there for the sake of that oh look at that meat stew perfect um what else would i like is that everything I want? I feel like that's everything I have, right? Let me take a look. And if there's anything else, I don't even care. I'll just get it later. Sausage rolls, curry, egusi soup and fufu, fried catfish, full meat pie, mud carp, afada stew, oxtail stew. Again, we don't really do ox, but um, we don't do oxtail, like, specifically, usually. But jollof rice is our thing. And the description does say it's a Nigerian staple just served with oxtail. Stuffed pancakes, chicken pepper soup, seafood effort, mushroom, spaghetti bolognese, and creamy soup with wonton, pineapple fried rice, chicken soup with beans and green salad, meat stew and tomato sauce, and steamed broccoli. Perfect. I'm going to get rid of all of these because I don't imagine she Whoa, oh my goodness. I don't imagine she... What the heck? <laughs> I don't imagine that she would be selling ice cream here. I think it would be... They're, they're like called donut holes, but like here, that's... But that's not what it is we're making. It's just the closest thing I can think of that looks like what I, I'm describing. So Puff Puff is what I'm looking for. And it's like fried dough, but it's just like... I don't know. It's not necessarily... 
I'll put in this mince pie because it's like a meat pie that I was looking for. Like, it looks like this, but it's not a donut. So, I don't know. If you've had fufu, you know what I'm saying. And if you haven't, you... If you've had fufu, if you've had puff puff, you would know what I'm saying. And if not, I'll put up a picture. But it's very hard to explain. It looks like a donut hole, but it simply is not that. Um, we do like our donuts. So maybe she makes... Is there like a plain donut? No, the plain one. Look at these. These all have like things. Chocolate glaze. I feel like she could have a chocolate glaze donut. Oh, original. There we go. Original chocolate. And then we like jam donuts too. That's a Dolce de Leche one. I want one that's like... It's always very sweet on the inside. Like it's so sweet. Um, I could do this. Because apple pie is just... I don't know. I feel like it's even less common than whatever is going on here. Oh, you know what? I'll just do this. Wait, these are all Krispy Kreme donuts. Am I on something? What on earth? <laughs> Why did I... Okay. I'm not even going to ask. There we go. Chocolate donut. Glazed donut. Cream filled donut. Boom. Oh, we'll just get donut holes instead of the first. I don't know what the first one I got was. Um, fruit crepes. Da, 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 da. I already got a plain donut. Uh, I got a glazed donut. Okay, here's a plain donut. Um, gosh, Nigerians love. Uh, yeah, I don't think it's a Nigerian thing. I just hate that weddings insist on having fruit cake. That's what I should say. It has nothing to do with Nigerians, actually. I've had these the whole time. I forgot. To, I didn't know. I would have put them in my Starbucks thing. I uh, do that. My favorite flavor of ice cream is Stracciatella. I had that in Nigeria at a movie theater. So good. That's my stomach rumbling. If anyone can hear. Uh, is there anything else I want? I don't think so. I don't think so. So I'm gonna get rid of the buenuelos. Buenuelos. Leaving mince pie, chocolate donut, cream filled donut, donut holes, glazed donut, and plain donut. Perfect. Menu sorted. Save. And then I have gender more not loud. Up and coming. Cool. And now we should rename this though. What should we name this? I actually haven't thought about it. Why don't we just name it Cheese Food Truck for now? I know that doesn't sound creative, but I have a name for a restaurant. It's just um. We're just not there yet. Okay. Let's save. Now, if she has a lot of satisfaction points, I will be using them to purchase perk points because I think that that is necessary for her to thrive in this. And if she already has used her life experience to gain all those satisfaction points, I might as well use them where it matters. But before we get to that, let's deal with employees. So we're not hiring another... We're not hiring a chef because we're going to be the chef. I do think, though, that it would be important for her to hire a waiter. That's a host. I think it's important for her to hire a waiter. Oh my god, Molly's here. Molly should be the waiter. That, that's the end of that. I'm sorry. I think that it'd be cool if they were together as friends and Molly wants to learn more about the culture and everything. What? This would be amazing. Oh, am I dreaming? I don't even know. Um, all right. Now, there's still some more stuff to do, though. I've set the menu. I have set the... I'm going to leave this as is. I put it down and kind of like... I, it's everything I wanted it to be. So, I'm just going to leave it alone. I am going to lock this for everyone but employees. Because when I just place in a different save, people just started walking in the house. Um, okay. Or walking in the place. Now, also... We have to go into Carl's Dine Out settings. And now we're going to set all this up. So I'm leaving this on because I want usual diners from Dine Out to appear as guests. Delivery orders on. Orders replaced online by Sims. And a Sim will show up to pick up the meal at the chef station. I think I'm fine with her doing delivery orders because Uber Eats and all that stuff. Walk up diners. Let's see. Sims who come directly to the chef station or a diner. Order beacon to place an order will now spawn. I don't think I want that. Oh, actually, no. Wait, what do I want? I want them to seat themselves. So, okay, let's see. Maximum waiting, group, waiting groups none. No additional dining groups will spawn when all the tables are full. I like that. I don't, I don't want to deal with too much chaos right now, if I'm being honest. Extra standard diners. Um, so more diners than usual. No. Extra children. I don't think I need extra children. Sims spawn closer on. Yes, I want them to show up closer. Host walks, guests to seat. Off. I'm not hiring host. Guest seats themselves on. Great. Guests place their own. No, I want them to wait. The owner or waiter will need to take orders for the table. Diners pick up meal. No, I would like it to be delivered. Because I tried that yesterday and just didn't work. Sous chef system on. Maybe later. I don't think right now. Waiters take orders on. Waiters deliver food on. Sims eat politely on and then i would also like to repeal all action plans here because i just i'm not all right so that's everything and then i'm going to set as delivery station and also um what is it sas player chef station great i think i want to put like a window here or something because like they're using this for deliveries all right let me let me let me figure something I decided to leave it there because in my other game, people are able to pick it up just fine from there. And it just means the waiter has to go into the kitchen a few times. But I'd actually rather leave it at that. So never mind. Sorry for wasting your time. Okay. We have to go meet Ed. Oh, my gosh. We have to go meet Adam. Where should we take him? Oh, my gosh. Okay. Kachi is in love with Mila Munch. All right. These two came into All-in-One City Park. I don't know what I was thinking. Um, it is raining here. <laughs> and yeah. But it could be a romantic thing, you know? <laughs> it could be like... 
I'm trying to justify this in my head instead of just taking them somewhere else. Should I take them somewhere else? Do I want to do that? Okay, why don't you guys just go here together? Look, you'll be protected from the rain and everything. Let's go run. Don't get wet. Run, run. Run, run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. You're a monster. I'm not the monster here. You are. You and the rest of those fairy tale creatures ruining my perfect world. <laughs> oh, this is what I hate about recording. Like my whole flow of consciousness is just here forever. Oh, really? You had an umbrella? We're breaking up. You didn't You didn't share it with me. We're breaking up. We're breaking up. I'm just kidding. She has to use the bathroom. Well, good thing you are near a bathroom, sweetie. You are near one. Oh, she has to buy a portable. So much is happening. Come here. Talk to this man. Be like... Hint about wanting proposal. No. No, no, no. Affection. You should say, I love you. This is the love I have ever wanted, and I hope we are forever. I think you mean this is the love you've always wanted, sweetie. I'm sorry to be the one correcting you again, but this is why we work. <laughs> She's going to tell him he makes her happy, and then offer a rose that I didn't know you had. Why did I spend money on that other flower if you had this? And then, how do you ask? Yeah. Ask to join household be like hey oh wait i think they can talk about moving in together hold on oh no it's talk about moving in with your best friend yes 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 okay he said yes oh my gosh okay so this is family say bye to your auntie He's coming here. Is he bringing any money with him? I would hope so, sir. You're like 25 years old. Um, How much did he bring with him? I was going to bring 4K. They live together now. Oh, hello, sir. Who are you? He loves the banter. He's happy in love. It feels good to make someone happy and especially someone I love. He's flattered from the compliment she gave him. He wants to be an admired, I oh, that's a high school attribute or aspiration. No, no. Oh, uh, wait, what does he want? What is he, what is he interested in? Wait, what, what are you, I don't even know who you want to be. Do you want to go to college? Can't go with you, at least not right now. Okay, he's a bro, sporty, child of the ocean, goofball. He likes... Um, handiness and painting. He doesn't like writing. Okay. He likes handiness and painting. Maybe he is an artist. That could be kind of cool. You want to try that, buddy? Want to try that old buddy, old pal? Um, let's go to creativity then. Master of the arts. Is there not like one that came with the game? Then I can do artist photographer. Oh, this is, oh, okay, 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 okay. I don't know if that's necessarily where he's at. I feel like he's more a <laughs> platinum artist. Painter extraordinaire. There we go. Ill at easel. Yeah. So maybe you could try this. I think he could try that. And then, but for now, he's a wave watcher. Cool. Is this a high school job? Or it looks like it is. So we're going <laughs> to... We have to get you a new job. Did I have him quit his job yet? No. I think he he should try it. And then as he gets more into painting, I think he, they can have more serious conversation about his life. For now, I'm not going to make too many changes. Okay, you guys. Let's go home. No, we can't go home. We got to go to Thrifty. We got to go to Thrifty. Okay, baby. Let's go. Oh, I love this like mural thing. It's so cute. Do you guys want to take a selfie here? Why don't you go here together? Take a selfie. 
Oh no. Wait, let's even oh I thought she had the camera in her inventory. You don't have money again. <laughs> okay. I hope they stand in the right spot. These people don't know how to act. Shocking. Aw, they are still cute though. I just need you to face the right direction. <laughs> I just need you to face the right direction, okay? Go here. Is this cute? Yes. Still want to get what I want to get though. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. You guys are cute. It's just like the plant is sticking out of his head, you know? That this is my first Let's Play couple. I am so proud. Honest to God. I, I love them too much. Okay, go here. Take a photo with him. Oh, he just came to give her a kiss on the cheek. Okay. Why do you insist on there being a tree coming out of this boy's head? Why? Why are you insisting on that? Girl has to pee. So go over here and pee like the champion that you are. And Edem, why don't you come? Where's the money you brought? I feel like I probably forgot to move that over. Come order some bubble tea. Oh, he's already ordering food. What are you ordering? Look at this one. I don't know why I have all these things in my game. What are you ordering? You're watching a fashion routine. Is somebody modeling right now? Adam, is this your drink? All right, chitara. Oh, your dad's calling you. Hey, honey, it's dad. When are you going to come visit? I put all my love and effort into raising you. You can at least drop by once in a while and tell your old dad you love him, can't you? It's just like, <laughs> it's not, it's, okay. I'll say I'll visit you tomorrow as in I'll visit you soon because she can't go to Nigeria tomorrow. She has to open her restaurant tomorrow. Um, Speaking of, I need to plan that, so um add event Tadara, create a fashion look oh wait she doesn't have that much money hold on hold on <laughs> let me transfer some money from her account this feels too real transfer from well she has 3k in the food truck fund so why don't you give yourself how much did she give herself why don't you give yourself 13 We're gonna make like 3K and she's gonna stay up a bit tonight <laughs> to cook that food. Okay, check the latest trends. What is in right now? I think that's that's probably where I messed up last time is, oh no, last time it's just that it was basic. Rocker trend is high and country is low. Okay, so we'll create, I think maybe two rocker looks. All right, let's get started. So I'm gonna first of all see what rocker tops they have. So they have this one, this one, and this one. Ooh, okay, so I like this jacket. I think I could do something with this jacket. And then in a second look, like this, oh, I don't know if I like that much. This one might work a bit better. I think I kinda like that. Cool, and then, we're going to go pants, and let's look for rocker pants as well. So we have this, this, this. Let me see what I can wear with this. Oh, that's too much pride. That is too much pride. That is. Okay, so I kind of do I like this one. I don't know what this one to go with. I feel like I want it with something skinny. As long as it doesn't show up in country. Okay, cool. It's not in country. And then with this one, do any of the pants work? The rocker pants. So these two are the same pants. Let's see what you do. I can convince somebody to wear on their body. So not that. Okay, cool. Let's see what else. Ooh, I love when there's some CC. Ah. Yeah, this could work. So that's my logic. 
<laughs> don't ask my logic, don't ask the temperature, don't ask, okay? <laughs> don't ask any question. Ooh, what are you? There's something about you, something about you, something about you, girl. I don't know why I allow this to cause me, so, cause me so much anguish. I'm just gonna do this. Yeah, I'm gonna do these pants. I wish I had like... Whatever. Me not caring anymore, the whole vibe. Um, now let's see, is there any rocker here? No rocker, okay. But this is just an outfit that happens to make its way in here, and I'm obsessed. So, let's do this one. Heck yeah. Which I'm glad I'm wearing that. I also really like this blue. What would she do, so? What would she do? Or would she just do black? Nah, let's do... Uh, no, but I want everybody to wear it, because like that skin tone is just really great. Purple could be good. Let's see. Anyway, I have to do with shoes now, anyway. Shoes. <laughs> The shoes are just never the right vibe, man. Never the correct vibe at all. Like, what is this? <laughs> what is this? Okay, sure. Call that a look and call that a day. Then, oh, we have to pick a style. So we'll call this Mash Cool, I guess. All right, this one, what are we doing for shoes? Oh, God, I forgot how much I can't stand <laughs> the base games you see sometimes. Okay. No. Um, what kind of rocker are you, man? <laughs> What is your brand of rocker? It's a good look. Yeah, it's like a... Like Lily Vanderwoodson going on tour with the dude. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Alright, shoes. Oh, no. <laughs> I really wished I would have actual CC. Oh, what are you? What are you? It's very like... Just make it casual? Just make it casual thing. Yeah? Just make it casual thing? Like this? I could do that. We could do a casual thing like this. Yeah. Let's just leave it casual. Leave it simple. How many times do you think I say casual? <laughs> Neon rainbow. Are there any accessories? Is that a hat? Nothing. I got it. Except this one. <laughs> no, nothing else. Ooh, this bucket hat. Could be a button. Just throw a bucket hat in there. <laughs> just, uh, imagine if I see people wearing this around town. I will lose my mind. Okay. That's actually pretty. What? That's a good price. Should I mess around and do one more? No. I should not. Ooh, they got love on the brain. Hey. Must be love on the brain that got me feeling this way. Uh, sounds like y'all got something to do. Lord. Okay. Let me let me just make the room. Let me just make it. <laughs> let me just make the room, eh? Let me I'll, I'll do some things. I'll do some magic. All right, okay. I moved it so that he could sleep here. This is his side of the bed. Let's give the right side of the bed to Damn, he's got his own bedside table, 135 bucks. We could do it. And now, hey, she can't. <laughs> they can't, they can't, they can't. Hold on. Oh no. Abort. Uh, Adam, she has to cook. Why don't you run to the store? The wicked store. What? Loud music. Yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, you've been known <laughs> that this is how I was living. I call you like every night. So, oh, he likes fashion. Wait, what? Seeing all those amazing fashions has given Adam a desire for a wardrobe refresh, and he found the ideal spot. Also, he was happy that he was shopping. All right, we could give you a look at some point. Let's have you go over to the store, though. He is going to get, he can get her some more lady products, but he also needs to get her this. She probably wanted a couple chill pills and he has to get himself this. Oof, $305 Lord. Okay, Chidera, I know you're tired. I understand. You're gonna take a power nap and you're gonna get right into it, okay? I'm sorry. I'm sorry to do this to you. Let us cook some breakfast. Corn beef hash, let's go. Adam, hurry on home now. Oh, she doesn't have any like nice sleeping things. She also has never done this before. <laughs> She's never done this before. Oh my gosh, my baby. Yeah, girl, take your power nap. Come on. And then make that corned beef hash and then he should be home. Carry umbrella. Come here. Are you hungry or not? Okay, you're going to go in the fridge and get whatever you want to get. In fact, I'll just let you pick. You're joining the cooking. Thank you, babe. What? That's so nice. I'm joining the cooking. He's like, don't stop my account. Like, I trust you. 
He's like, yeah, you better trust me. Haven't you seen what I can do? He's like, mm, I've seen what you can do. How about you make me a crab boil soon? Ooh, I could do that. He's like, come on, I'll prep everything, please. And she's like, okay, fine, 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 fine. She's like, I think crabs are like dinosaurs and they're really weird. <laughs> can y'all focus? Adam, I thought you were hungry. Okay, thank God he's getting over it because like I'm in no mood. What's he feeling? Happy in love, steal. Look at him. He's like, I'm just going to offer you emotional support because I can't really do anything. He's like, oh, that smells so good. She's like, yep, you know it do. He's like, I've never had corned beef. And she's like, you need to have it more because my corned beef hash is unlike anything you've ever experienced. Hurry up. Mucho peachy. Mucho pachu. Now where's he gone? <laughs> He's gonna eat some hummus. Yes, that's my healthy man. You better eat that. Look how he's looking at her. Oh my gosh, he loves this woman. He loves her. Okay, what does it say? Nope, not for him, not for him, not for him, but for her. It doesn't count. No. Okay, put this here. <laughs> we'll sell it. Don't worry, girl, we'll sell it. What's she doing? Oh, she, she's gonna chat with him? Okay. Well, Adam has a gift for you, for you. So Adam, why don't you hand her the gift you have for her? I wish you could give multiple gifts, you know? Bro gift. What even is that? Okay, give her the birth control pills. And then you, my dear, are gonna open up these. Mm. Oh. He's like, thank you, babe. What does she think? Like, oh, I know what you're trying to say. He's like, what? I'm not saying nothing. <laughs> She's like, I know. We already talked about it. Take a pill. And she's like, okay, well, I haven't given you a full tour. You haven't ever really seen my bedroom, which is weird because it's going to be your bedroom. And you'll be like, yeah, that's true. And then they get in here, and then she says, What the heck? Not him sleeping. Good. You better wake up. Look at her, standing there in her flared pants. Heck yeah! Chitter has learned his woohoo interests. All right! Yep. I normally would never give him privacy, but unfortunately, Chitter is my. Break out the candles, make it romantic. Chitter and Adam are woohooing for the first time. Oh, and it's his first time too. Oh, that's so cute. That is so adorable. I, I, I think she should just go to bed for the night, if I'm being honest, because she's had a big day and she still has to like do with the restaurant tomorrow. Y'all need to, oh, she needs this money though. She needs a laundry machine. Let's see what her satisfaction points are over here. How tired is she? Not that tired at all. So you know what? If you're awake and we have enough stuff, we'll get you a moodlet solver and get you going for tomorrow. How's that sound, girl? You ready to just power through this with me? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Okay. Go make the full fry up. When you're done making that, you are also going to make some crumpets. And then when you are done with that, you have to make what? Three? Okay. Once you're done making those crumpets, you are then going to make, ooh, some stuffed pancakes. Yes, girl, you are. Now let's, while she's doing this, look at her. She has 2,925 satisfaction points. Now, if I wanted to get retail perk points, <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're gonna do it. We would have 35, no, restaurant, sorry, restaurant. <laughs> that would have been so bad. We'd have 35, we'd have 5,000 is insane but again she's gonna be working pretty much by herself so i need all the help i can get and i'm trying to get this let's play going i'm just trying every day and then she has does she have enough for mood let's all her she does not that's okay she can probably make a gourmet meal and get enough while she's cooking i'm gonna have her get her perks so i think i would like for her to have the curious customers like oh nigerian food truck what is that know what i mean um, additional waiter. I don't know if I should do that now. I think I'll wait. Ingredient unlocks the ability to choose the quality of meal ingredients. Yes. 
I want her to have that. Meal rush, that has to happen kind of on site. She always has a discount on ingredients. Uh, I don't know why she would have that at this moment. Patient patrons, I think that, that would be fair because like they're like, new place, she's very young, you know. Um, curiouser customers, they now request dish recommendations. Hmm. Um, not at this moment because we haven't even, you know, done the first one. And she can inspire her employees by making inspirational speeches. Faster eaters. Yeah, they'll like clear their plates. <laughs> Let me see if there's anything I want other than that. Um, so faster eaters is one. Lower employee training costs. Yes, because she's our friend. So I think that actually, actually is really good. Customers will choose the more expensive menu items. I like that idea, but also I don't know. I kind of want fast eaters so we can get people in and out of there. So I'm going to do that. Okay. We got quite a few nice ones. Okay, girl, let's cook. We'll power through this. And then I'm probably just going to have her wake up tomorrow and then we'll start this. All right. I'm also going to quickly have her just promote her stuff. Her clothes. Okay, come on, girl. We don't got all this time with all these piles of clothes you leave everywhere. <laughs> yes, promote that look. Oh, people like it. Okay. Move outfit. Sell it on trendy. For how much? Mm, that one looks expensive. Stick to our. Okay. Why don't you wear this one? Oh my gosh. You're sick. Oh, chair, please. Giggly from illness. First woohoo. You liked it? I'm saying I love you. Sharing decor. Oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, anyway, can you please promote this look or what's happening? This one's more pieces, so you're gonna sell it for more. It's an outfit on trendy for. Ooh, people don't like this one. Ah, okay, I'll make that one a thousand. Cool, nice side money to acquire, girl. Okay, well. Resume stuffed pancakes. <laughs> oh, there are piles of clothes everywhere. She that's why I'm trying to have her hurry up so she can get a what's it called? Washer dryer. I just want to be able to afford it. They're asking me if Adam wants to go to university. Oh my gosh. Okay, deliver catered food. I think I can do that now. What? Oh, right, okay. Pack this, please. Sometimes it just doesn't go into the thing. I find it so annoying. Are you okay? You're hungry? Okay, well, don't eat this. Like, do not even think about touching it. Don't even think about thinking about it. Okay, go drop this off. I've done this in a weird order, but she's going to come home and then talk to the client. And then, boom, we'll have our payment. Amazing. Adam. <laughs> ah, do you work today? Yeah, I think he's going to want to go to university probably. He'll probably go from home. I think that that could be something cool. He could want to go to university and try to study, you know, something so he can get out of this job. And I think she would encourage him to do that. Take all of these to the hamper. Wait, have you not eaten? What's going on? Where's the food you're eating? Dude, eat. Do whatever you want. <laughs> Why are you making everything so weird? Why did you even decide to make that when you had this in your inventory the whole time? Okay, wait, what's he feeling? Still annoyed by the mess. Fair. <laughs> Chidera, you're still in pajamas. Why don't you come and take everything to the hamper, please? Ooh, she just got some money. Okay, 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 they have money again, they have money again. Okay. Um, Money is available. We can definitely get a wash and a dryer. She's going to come clean this. Oh, my girl is hungry. Then eat something, my good sis. Eat something. Which is something I should do too. Now, I'm a bit worried about this weather. I'm going to be very honest with you. But we'll see. Everyone's got an umbrella over there. So I think we should head over at about noon. Quick shower. Nope, not you, not you, not you, not you. All right, does she need a shower? No, but she does need to eat something. You're having a quick meal? Okay, just have a croissant then. 
have an almond one. The mom is staying. Hurry up. Oh, who's calling Adam? His mom. Hey, Adam, you're notorious. You're so notorious that one of your unscrupulous friends has been asking to meet you. Can I give them your one of her friends? Oh, uh, yeah, you can't say no on your Nigerian mom wants you to. Yeah, just. Who is singing? Oh, it's him. Yes, you better sing, sir. You better sing to your heart's content. This rain is raining. Okay, did you finish eating? Because I know you just put that in the nether regions or something. Let's take you to work. Oh, she hasn't changed. It's okay. She's going to be playing as a chef anyway. I'm so nervous. <sighs> I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I wonder how today's going to go. I think she should pay for some promotion. Personally, advertising. I think she should do gold package. Uh, standard ingredients are fine for now. Okay. Let's open the shop and it's also not raining here thank goodness all right my love come here and cook orders as chef oh it's happening it's happening it's happening wait what are what are those other perks about somebody coming or people showing up meal rush there we go people will stop by to eat at my restaurant yeah i think it's worth a shot okay uh that's what you're wearing okay <laughs> you know what i can't be bothered i guess we just watch and play now we'll just stop by at moments when like you know things happen all right this guy seated himself things are going well <laughs> That is my parameter for if things are going well. I'm gonna keep the wall down so I can see her. Molly, you better get off your phone. Playing with our bestie. Hi, girl. Hey, hey, girl, hey. Uh, you can't afford a moodlet solver, can you? You cannot. But you just cooked gourmet meals. <laughs> I'm grunting in disdain. Hey, those two are trying to read their menu. Molly, are you taking people's orders? What are you doing? Where are your glasses? Oh, the poor girl probably cannot see. She's itching? Girl, you got the lice? Well, he, you're his first time too, so I guess just like. Dina Caliente wants to purchase Mashcore? The one that's 2000? Yo. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. I want to see what people get. D where, where did you get a Starbucks from? Oh, he made it. You wish that was better service? It's okay. I'll talk to her. I'll talk to her. I can't talk to her now because like, you know, look, there's the to-go orders. I just, I need to see how this is going to go. Caleb Valter wants to purchase Neon Raver. Yo, this is the one that's 1500. Bro, should I have changed this price? <laughs> Okay, let me stop. Let me stop. Somebody just bought food. Was it like a to-go order? Oh my gosh. Wait, let me save. Things are going nice. What? What? Oh, she's just completing aspirations left, right, and center. What do you mean? She hasn't even added anything to this. What aspiration is she completing? Okay, let's see whose food is who's getting their food first. Molly's delivering food to Dustin Broke. And Dustin got himself some moi moi and a Guinness. Yes, sir. What is that quality? What is that? Excellent. Normal. Well, she's not responsible for that part. So it is what it is. Lovely. Oh my gosh. And he's over here talking to Caleb Fleming. Oh, uh, what is up with this whole friendlier service thing? I'm going to have to have a chat with her. She has lice. Crab lice. Yes, I, I'm aware. Uh, I'm going to... I'm going to bring you here. And then you're going to go to the store and get you guys some shampoo for your crab lice, okay? Thank you. What on earth? Okay. Oh. Does he have it too, though? He lost. Oh, no. It's like no money. Anyway, Kayla got herself what? Meat stew and tomato sauce and steamed broccoli. It's excellent. And she got herself a Heineken. 
grat gratte as the people say yeah he has it too okay cool it's okay you guys will make money she still hasn't even like chatted with her client to get the 3k it's okay she has until what thursday well that's him she has until thursday all good all good in the hood okay y'all come on eat 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 yes i know you're itching and you have your your hearing oh who's eating next this is not this flowing okay baby what did they get what did they get what did they get he got catfish and she got chicken pepper soup fried catfish excellent chicken pepper soup normal chicken rice pepper soup not your forte we should practice that they both got a hack. i love how this is going sir are you here to pick up like an order why are you just on your phone is it this order i think someone already picked up an order though Oh, 280. Yeah, she just came and picked up an order. Oh my god, the Uber Eats is flowing. Everything is... Oh my god, this is tired, though. I, I need... Like, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? <laughs> what do I do? What do I do, y'all? What do I do? Cook a gourmet meal. <laughs> like, But she has been cooking a gourmet meal. And for that reason, I'm saying yes. Like, sorry. <laughs> I almost swore I'm so upset. Like, she needs a moodlet solver ASAP. Because this is your first day, like, stay open, <laughs> you know? Drink this, and then... No. Stop. Drink that. And then... No, finish drinking it, drink it. I, you're not too tired to drink it. Drink it. Drink it. Not my voice cracking. Finish to drink! Oh my god, it takes them so long to drink these things. Adam, how did you get in? And you're supposed to go home. There we go. Oh my god. Adam, I said go home. <laughs> Adam doesn't want to go home. Holly Alta. Ooh, look who's here. Adaku. Oh my gosh. A Nigerian celebrity. Oh my gosh. The notable newcomer too. That was so cute. And she got a Guinness. Okay. Has Holly also not gotten her food yet? Like. Okay, so now all they know is crab lice. <laughs> That's all they know now. They don't want to talk about nothing different. 1979. Doing pretty. Yes, we know. We know. Oh. It's so one note. Holly, are you complaining? You're not happy about the wait times here? I'm not happy either. I don't know what's going on. We're going to close it at the 7 hour mark. Oh, we're probably going to lose Holly. 420. At least we're getting on deliveries. I don't know how to make Molly work harder. Oh my god. No. No, 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 no. No. Her mom just doesn't stay in her world. <laughs> like what in the spying? I'm not I'm not humoring that concept. She's in Nigeria right now. Adam, go home y'all the wait times are horrible what oh there we go look 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 food's coming food's coming oh no food's coming yes 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 keep talking to adaku you keep talking to dennis yep yep yep. just start serving people who are you serving is that for holly holly your food made it oh she's like i was doing it for my youtube channel look at that what did she get she got curry and she got Guinness. Why is everyone getting Guinness? Is all well? Yes, Chidera. Go, 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 go. Adam, go home. <laughs> I understand that you're probably like trying to help, but can you go home? Maybe it's because an event is happening. That's on me. She's like, it's spicy. Girl, what do you think this was? <laughs> It is spicy. Molly, look, there's food. Go get it. Go get it. Go get it. Oh my god, no Adam, be helpful. I should have been using him to help this whole time. I hear it. I hear everyone saying it. Hey, who's next? We're almost at the seven hour mark. It's you. What did you get? He got oxtail and jollof. Okay. The Hennessy cocktail. 
Well, at least we gave you your food. Thank goodness. She's like, it's so spicy. She said, take a look at this. This meal is amazing. Oh, my girl is breathing fire and loving it. I'm here for it. I'm so here for it. You know? Well, I think at the 8-hour mark is when my good sis here is going to start to get herself. 7.20. Ooh, from a to-go order? Probably. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to wait until the 8-hour mark because that's when my good sis is going to be like, hey, could you send me home? You know? And she's already looking. You come here, actually. You can manage her. Pay for training. Stop mixing drinks. Yeah, you can dislike mixology. And then you're also going to check up on her. You can't really criticize her because she was doing her job. So just thank her for a good day of work. And we're at two stars now. Okay, is he done talking to her? Keep the compliments rolling. I can't get enough of them. Sick. Close. Okay, so we made 4,099 simoleons on our first day. We spent 308 on ingredients. We made 37.91 in meal profits. We owe zero. Are we not paying Molly? We'll just give her money after each shift. That's what I think we'll do. Advertising cost 78, net profit 37.12, growth opportunities, personal touch, try interacting more with the customers. I think Edem might help her with that then while he's figuring out his stuff. Maybe he'll be helping her at the restaurant. I'm kind of down with that. Service, try training your hosts and waiters to level up their skills, but the meal quality is exceptional. And then Molly's good and she has to get trained. Awesome. That's amazing. That's amazing. Um, wait. Molly, stay. So I know you're about to leave right now. Adam, could you please come give her give gift? Oh, he doesn't know her. Yikes. Okay. <laughs> Say hello. She's the employee. No, girl, stay. We gotta talk to you. He's like, I love painting. She's like, you look goofy as hell. <laughs> Get off the floor. Give her a gift. Can you give her money? What is a bro gift? What a condom. <laughs> wait. Oh, wait. I guess you can't just, like, give money like that. Right. Okay. So we can go home and we'll just e-transfer her at home. All right. Chitter made her money. She made 5K. She made 500. Oh, they paid her, like, 5,000. Wow. Okay, so they've got some money. I want them to have some conversations now. Oh, wait. They're about to get some more money. Hold on. Chidera, come over here. Okay, why don't you ship this to Caleb, the tour? I'll just keep clicking until you do it. You're going to do it at some point. There we go. Boom, 1,500. <gasps> And Caleb wants to purchase something else? Oh my gosh. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Come back. All of our stuff got purchased in one day. What? She's sitting with $5,500 in her... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. This girl has 14,114 simoleons. That's amazing. Okay, you know what? We're gonna choose peace tonight because these people are all making their noises over here. Adam, why don't you handle them for the night? <laughs> yeah, you're the one who's mad about them anyway. So why don't you come pound on the door? Chidera, can you get any jobs or do you have to? Yeah, you have to quit again. It's all good. What is that? Rude client. Oh, the client was rude. Well, it's, it's a good thing you didn't talk to them until the end. <laughs> it is a good thing you didn't talk to them until the end. All right, Adam, show them. Let Adam show them. Open this door. <laughs> Ooh. They say what now? What is this? Seeing an ugly sim. First of all, he doesn't like how you look. So things are not going well. Complain angrily about noise. Look, man, I just moved here. This is too much. You got on Gucci shoes or whatever while you're doing whatever in there like 
did you hear me all night last night? And I'm with the love of my life. He's like, yeah, I live here too. Blah, 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 blah. It's saying it as if Chidera is saying it. You know what? Just go away. Whatever. At least, did they stop? Does he stop at least? Yeah, at least he stops. So, okay. Why don't you come sit and chat here? Nope. Sit here. And Chidera, you're going to sit here. We have to have a conversation. We have to have a conversation. Oh, they're both sopping wet and they have to get rid of their crabs. She's gonna be like, I don't know, she should just appreciate them. Tell them you love them. Give them a kiss. Tell them he looks good. You are my soulmate. Enthused about his family. I love you so much. I'm glad we're soulmates to be together forever. Give him a massage. Look at him. Tickle him. Aww. Make out. They're such an adorable couple. Tease flirtatiously. And then make a move. Anyway, in all this, I'm going to deduce that they had a conversation where he said he would try to help her in the store as often as he can. So, yeah. Did he have work today? He did not. Oh, he does not. Oh, so on these days, he can help us at the, at the restaurant. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay. So. Teacher sign up bonus. You're not doing that. What if he wants to be a teacher? Oh my God. Okay. This reminds me of a let's play that I really do love, but it could be fun. I don't know if I'll be as hands on with it, but like, it could be cool if he wants to teach kids art. That could be really cool. Are y'all still making money moves? Okay. Well, you guys can't really do anything. Chidera, come here and take a shower. You got to use your crabs medicine. <laughs> you got to take one of them. Look at them. They love each other so much. They are willing to do this in front of each other. You use medicine. There we go. Itching be gone. All right. Let your man go in now. All right. And then you know what you're going to do? You're going to come over here and you're going you gonna to show that girl you, you, you love her. You're going to show her what he do, baby. <laughs> I am so upset with what I just said. Is this weird? Yes, but they're here and they're sleeping. So uh, I think for the next episode, I am going to have her grind it out at the restaurant. And she's all sweaty. They both are. I love how he's like sleeping on her too. <laughs> they're exhausted. I looked at their moodlets and she was like, happy with spectacular woohooing. So they had a good time. Um, they're going to focus on getting that money. They have to make 65 K right now they have 14. So they are, you know, they're moving steady considering what they had at the beginning of the episode. I love them so much. They're just, oh my gosh. I don't know what life is going to have in store for them. I think I do like the idea of him starting to work on maybe going to school to get a, a degree so that he can teach. That would be really cool. So I'm going to have him do that and then I'm going to have her grind it out. And hopefully, I like the idea that they love living in the city. So maybe they just move to a nicer place in the city when they have more money. That could be another, you know, part of our finale for this whole thing. It could be her getting the restaurant, him going to school and them living in a nicer apartment. That's the hope. That's the dream. All that being said, that'll be the end of today's episode. I hope you had the most fun with Chi because Chi is indeed all that. And so is Adam. Get those dust bunnies off your toes and close the door behind you because Somalian says, see you later. Bye.